Hey guys, Jed Adatan, aka Jed here, and in today's snowboard topic, let's talk about base materials, which base on a snowboard is best, because I was reading some forum threads online, and people are really confused as to which snowboard base type is best, and there's some mistakes that people are making when they're thinking about bases. So, firstly, there are two main types of snowboard bases. There's extruded bases and sintered bases. So, those two bases are the main bases that you find in 99 percent of all snowboards so basically all snowboards have those bases in them so the common mistake that people make is thinking that extruded bases are more durable but slower than sintered bases that's not true so the truth is actually that sintered bases can come in a few different constructions and they can come from softer than extruded up to way more durable than extruded bases so depending on the type of sintered base that you have it's actually tends to be more durable faster and better than extruded bases so in most cases when you see a snowboard with a sintered base it will be more durable it'll be faster it will absorb wax better and it's just generally a better base than extruded bases but the downside of a sintered base is that it's harder to maintain and repair. So it's more expensive to repair basically. But outside of that, you generally, if you have to choose between your two bases, you always want a sintered base. They're just, they're just better bases. But with extruded bases, you'll find them in mid to low end snowboards typically because that's where companies put that base on those snowboards to save a bit of money in construction costs. So. Extruded bases on the whole aren't as good as sintered bases, but the upside of them is although they're slower than sintered bases, although they tend to be less durable than sintered bases, they're easier to repair if they get damaged. So maintaining them and repairing them is a lot easier than a sintered base. So that's basically the difference between the two bases. So if you get confused, just remember sintered bases are the good ones. They're the bases that you want in your snowboard, but you typically only find them in mid to high end snowboards. Extruded bases are the bases in the mid to low end snowboards, depending on what the company chooses to do with your base materials. But if you can, you want a sintered base in your snowboard. But don't make it, don't make it a huge deal where all extruded bases are horrible and you never buy a snowboard with an extruded base that's that's just ridiculous you it's just another factor that factors into how good a snowboard is on a whole but there are plenty of really amazing snowboards with extruded bases um, for example the Arbor Westmark I believe is on a sintered uh, not on sintered on a extruded base this year and they changed it. I'm not sure why they changed it from a sintered base probably the safe cost but yeah, so the Arbor Westmark and Blacklist, I believe, are extruded bases this year, and that's fine. I mean, I think they'd be better with sintered bases, but they're still amazing park snowboards. It's still one of the top park snowboards out there. So don't feel like if it has an extruded base, it sucks. It's, that's not true. It's just another factor that factors in. So remember, extruded bases are the cheaper, but less durable, less speed, and easier to maintain and repair. But the sintered bases are the faster ones but they're more expensive and they're harder to repair and more durable as well so those are the pluses and minuses of each type of snowboard base hope that helps clear up some confusion if you guys have any more questions feel free to leave them in the comments below and i just opened up my new snowboard trick tip videos and training courses so if you're interested in advancing your freestyle you want some free trick tip videos learn how to do some 180s on the ground some butter tricks like ollies 360 spins that sort of thing then join my free snowboard training series here and i'll see you guys inside all right take care and i'll see you guys in the next video